you guys doing? Good, Good. how are you? I'm doing excellent. Uh, so I really enjoyed the show. I was constantly doing WTF after like every episode. Yeah. Go ahead. Um, so talk a little bit about that. How have you been describing it to people because Every episode, there's like a peel back of the onion. That's the yeah, that's w a good way to put it. Yeah, WTF is what I'm we've been start saying. That. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, it's yeah. hard to describe this Cause show because it's not a flat out comedy, and it's not a drama, and it's it's a dark comedy, but it's different. But than, it's not. What do we call it? A tramedy. Yeah, tramedy. Because there's people going through trauma. But it's um, and there's an ad at the end of it, and then feel a suspense like killer too. Yeah. Suspense? Yeah. Suspenseful. 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 Full of suspense. <laughs> right. And sad. Sadness. But happiness. And some happiness. It's well, a lot of things at once. The happiness is layered uh, underneath with a lot of sadness. Yeah. Under the But that's like life. Happiness. You know, when you're yeah. going through something terrible, it's some, somehow, you know, your sense of humor saves you. You two have great chemistry right now, but also great chemistry on the show. How long had you had you guys been friends or hang, hung out before no. the show? Or you just met. We this met thing? one time. We before. met one time before. Yeah, we went to lunch with uh, Liz Feldman, and, and we were already in. So yeah, if we, we didn't are, like each other, we were going to be in trouble. Yeah, we were yeah. in trouble. Um, <laughs> Jessica Elbaum, who's our executive producer, and Liz Feldman, who created the show and um, showrunner, and we went to lunch, and that was the first time we met each other, and we just looked at each other and knew. I knew who she was, and she knew who I was. And we just knew. Sure. It, it seemed like just, it was going to be fun, too. And that's not, like, not on an actory level. Like, literally, like, am I going to be able to get along with this person? Yeah. Um, because we're going to have to go to a lot of places in the next three months together. And yeah. we're going to have to have trust and care and support and love. And we did. And we're going to have to be able to sit on the couch and answer questions yeah. together. In, in a dross. In a dress. <laughs> Not dross. Um, I have to ask you, what is it like the night before you're going to go sit down and have this meeting? Are you a little in your head, like, oh my god, I hope she likes me, or I hope I like her? Or are you sort of like, what's meant to be is going to happen? I'm like, god damn it, I have to take a shower. <laughs> <laughs> i got to go in public. She yeah, I'm be, like timing gonna, my dry. Am I going to be okay if my hair is like fully dirty and in a mom bun on top of my head? <laughs> you would be. You were. And I was. Yeah, we talked about that. Yeah. I told you I didn't shower that day. I actually didn't think I showered. <laughs> <laughs> that was the bulk of our conversation. Right. No. I don't like showers. I think, I don't you know, like for, me, it's, for me, when I met with Liz Feldman, who runs the show, she's like, I want to work with people who want to be here and I want to work with good people. So, um, I, I, nice people, and to me that's important. You know, I think we spent our we spent a long time in this career already, both of us, and I don't want to waste my time in an unhappy experience. Oh. I want to do good work, but I also want to have a good time. So, to me, that was something that was very exciting yeah, going I mean, into the show, and I had heard lots of nice things about about you. So. When you when you when Liz is describing the show to you, how much nowadays everything is all about you know what's going to happen next season and thinking about seasons down the road. Were you guys pitched on a plan for where the show could go, or is it sort of like, we're going to make season one and let's just see what happens? We had, to, she just wanted to concentrate on, for me, concentrate on season one. I've only heard that if there is a second season, I kind of know brought some broad strokes about, you know, now that we know, I don't know if you saw all ten, but now that we know what, do you know, there's yes. going to be some yeah. un unanswered questions, so those will be answered. Yes. Maybe, maybe Perhaps. not, or answered in the way that we answer it on this show, which is really not giving an answer because underneath that answer are a lot of other answers. Yeah, so we're talking about <laughs> this nothing is right now. So, so hard to describe. Um, right, exactly. It's hilarious. I'm just going to tell you that. No. No, I, I think there is a, a, I think if you know Liz Feldman, she's extraordinary. She's just got such a great mind and a great sense of humor, and, and I completely trust her. I think she has a lot of ideas of where it could go, and I think she really wanted to get the first season right, and, uh, and hopefully we did that. Yes, I think that without going into anything specific, that I think fans of the show, after they get through the first season, are going to want more. Okay. Perhaps Great. with the way That's things good. are. Great. Let me say it like that. Okay. Well, we appreciate we would like that. to. I'd like to find out what happened, and I'd like to know. Yeah. Sure. But I, I, I really need to know. I'm like, just going to write some fan fiction about <laughs> it and send it to you. You're going to. Do you do Yelp reviews for this? <laughs> For no, you know, you don't. No. Okay, I can't go on Yelp and be like, this show's fantastic. That's not going to make an effect for next year. I, I can see okay. where you spend extra time online. <laughs> yes. 
a, a few random questions sure. since we have to avoid spoilers. Uh, what for each of you? What TV show would you love to guest star on? Oh, I really Will and Grace, and I'm going to tell you, they look like they're having such an incredibly fun time. And to me, at 47 years old, having done this for 40 something years. I just want to be around people that make me laugh and that I have a good time. I'm sorry, we didn't laugh. We laughed a lot, but we also cried a lot. Well, yeah, we had okay. to. So it wasn't like that I didn't love our experience. Right. It was just you a just different. Love I just would like more. to go. I get it. No, I don't it's love cool. Grace more. I just I think I just want to go <laughs> giggle for like 3 days and then and then go home. Just giggle for 3 days and yeah. then go home. Especially after this, which was really intense but also giggly. I want to be on Wheel of Fortune. Does that okay. count? It, it 100% counts. <laughs> um, my, yes, my last you thing can be on Wheel of Fortune if you want to. I love Wheel of Fortune too. I was picked to be on Wheel of Fortune one time, but then I got my first acting job at the same on the same network, and I, I never got story. to be on Wheel of Fortune. I can't believe it. But I have been on The Price Is Right and The Family Feud. I think it's amazing. Is that you true? Know what I, all true. What is that? What is it? The show that Rob Lowe's doing right now with the ninja thing? I don't know. Oh my god, it's fantastic. Love my daughter loves it. I won't. I probably anyway. won't do it because I don't want anybody yeah. to see how bad I am at that. But that's my, that's my fantasy. Uh, my last question for you guys. Do you remember your first movie or TV show crush? Don Johnson, Miami Vice. That was very fast. <laughs> I took a picture with a cardboard cutout when I was on vacation with my family in Hawaii with him. I, I brought like it back to school. It was a Polaroid. The dude from Greece, too. I oh, know who you're talking about. Ma Malcolm Caulfield. Something Caulfield. Ma Maxwell Caulfield. No. Come on now. Which Maxwell Car <laughs> Who are you? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> um, thank you so much. Congrats on the show. Thank uh, you. I hope you get to make more episodes. Thank, thank you. you. It looks like you had some fun.